All right, right now I've got my telescope pointed in the constellation Leo for the double star Algeba, I believe. I'm not quite sure how to pronounce that, but uh, I got to make this one quick because the clouds are coming in quick. So I want to get this, this double star as quick as possible. So we will look at Stellarium to see where it's located in the sky. Then we'll get on with the sketch and I'll show you the uh, final version after bringing it inside. So stay tuned. Gamma Leonis, or Gamma Leo, also named Algeba, is a double star located in the constellation Leo. The name Algeba is Arabic for the forehead, but even with that name, the star is found in the neck or mane of the lion. This double star is around 130 light years away. The main star has a magnitude of 2.28 and is an orange red color and is estimated to be 23 times the size of our sun. The secondary star is a magnitude 3.51 with a yellow color, and while smaller, it is still 10 times the size of our sun. These two stars are separated by 4.5 arc seconds, so we'll require a bit of magnification to separate them. Now that we know where we're looking in the sky, let's get on with the sketch. Unfortunately, this isn't a very detailed sketch as the clouds were coming in, so I quickly plotted the double stars. Even while I did this, the clouds were getting thicker, and I spent as much time as I could trying to pick out any stars I could from the rest of the field of view, and then I was completely clouded out. So that about wraps it up for this sketch. Let's head inside and add some color to it. The primary star was a deep orange or red color in my eyepiece, while the second one was a bit more yellow or orange looking to me. I got two of my colored pencils that I felt showed these colors the best and colored in the stars. Unfortunately, the surrounding field isn't too interesting and I was only able to plot four more stars in the field of view. Interestingly, in 2009, a planet was found orbiting the primary star. It is a gas giant that is 8.78 Jupiter masses, it sits roughly one astronomical unit from the star, and takes over 400 days to complete a single orbit. Anyway, that about wraps up this sketch. Thank you very much for watching and clear skies.